Hello everyone, this is CypherDeck, and today we are playing Kinshi. This is a game I've played a long time. I've done several videos about the game. I ended up leaving the game because I couldn't get updates because no internet. Uh, finally, I've been able to get updates, and the game has completely changed. So, we have a situation here. We have the Armor King, is what this guy is called. He is a robot. Now, um, I need to, whoa, 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 <laughs> I don't know, there we go, let's go ahead and look at him, okay, so this is the Armor King, let's see if we can actually see his stats, his attack is 80, his defense is 80, <laughs> his strength is 77, his dexterity is 82, and his toughness is 78. My best guy, uh, let's just go over here, um, we'll go ahead and pick him, my best guy out of everyone that I have, his strength is 52, <laughs> his dexterity is only 29, his, t his toughness is 44, uh, we're about to try to take this guy out. Trying to look at anything else he has. KO point is 80. That means that it'll take negative 80 damage to actually knock him out. This is a raid boss <laughs> kind of situation, if you want to look at it that way. Um, his athletics is 150. He is pretty much probably unbeatable by my guys. But I want to try it. I want to try and see if I can take him on. Now, I want to talk also about all the changes that have happened to the game. But I figured this is a great way to start the game. Um, <clears throat> so, uh, before we start the fight, I want to tell you how I'm, I'm playing the game. Um, first thing, I just noticed an issue. Um, I have these squads uh, set up based on their skill. Um, I actually have a formula that I use to figure out who is the best. Ming Long is the top of our of our uh, guys. So we are actually in the first dynasty of the Legion. And the Legion is considered the Legion of Lun until Ming Long no longer either exists. As if he gets killed or if... Um, if someone else has better stats than he does, they will take over. So, why am I here? Why am I in the situation where I'm trying to take out this guy who isn't, who is obviously not trying to attack me? Well, let me show you. Let's take this guy. He's um, he's a newbie. Are you slow enough? <laughs> Okay, let's go ahead and have him talk to this guy. <clears throat> now you'll see that um, he is a merchant. We can talk to him. He sells merchant type things. He sells um, samurai armor. He sells this plate jacket that I've never seen before. It's new. He sells uh, the type of hat that I like to use on my guys. He also sells the samurai hat. And this weird helmet, armored hood, is what that's called. And that covers, um, let's see, coverage is, head is 90%. This is 100%, and that is 100%. And then um, this covers right and left leg and stomach, uh, stomach is 50%. And then you have the, the armor itself. It covers the chest, 90%, stomach is 75%, so you have double coverage of the stomach, and so on. Great armor, but he doesn't sell the recipes, which is why I want to kill him, because I'm hoping that this right here is going to allow me to get the recipes. So, I'm going to try something. I have this game saved currently. 
Um, what I'll do is I'll go ahead and have Minglong. I think he is currently our highest lock picker. Our, our highest they've actually he's only level nine. Um, let's see who else has lock picked. No one. He is at level nine. That is probably at level hundred because of the fact that this guy is so strong. No one else. No other. Oh wait a minute. I saw something. Um, oh, that's Steve Ruiz 5. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and have Ming Lung come over here. I'm not going to have him do it yet. Um, if you fail at stealing, then um, you can, you just keep, uh, keep trying to open it over and over and over until you finally open it. Um... Let's also talk about other issues that are going on. He is using the same kind of weapon we are. I am my my armor and everything is was made by my guys. The problem is it is standard armor, a standard weapon because we didn't have a grading system back whenever I started the game. So he is going to be overall he's going to probably have a massive weapon. Things like that. Um, I just I dread this whole situation, but I figure I want to try it once. I'm not considering this a if um, if Ming Lung dies, uh, the game is over. I'm gonna just use the save uh, and so on um, because this is me just testing things out. He's walking away, so I'm gonna go ahead. Oh 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 oh, Alt. Click. The safe. Does it give me any efficiency workers? Can I have up to five people working on it? Oh, if only he opens it, does it does do the attack? Um, let's get five people on it. Are you gonna attack me now that you see that I'm trying to open your safe? If this if this safe opens, you know what? <laughs> I'm probably not gonna even try to take. Uh, I feel that I feel the urge to steal. If oh what? Okay, he's actually saying something about what we're doing. If you feel the urge to steal, that's okay. It's natural. It's a natural feeling when pre uh, presented with such great armor. What? Uh, pick failed is all what I'm seeing here. Pick failed, pick failed, pick failed. Um, only when this thing opens is it going to actually... Let's go ahead and get these guys. Uh-oh. <laughs> Oh, wait a minute. Only everybody else is attacking. These other guys are still picking. Okay, we need to we need to stop what we're doing. Um, okay, he all of these guys are selected. These guys are selected. Attack all. Oh, he just took Jalen down in one swipe. He just took another guy down in one swipe. <laughs> this is literally a raid boss. We really do not want to be surrounding this guy like this. Um, because the stupid. Did he die? Is he down? Is he down? I, okay. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That's, that's one of the robots. Security. Okay, but his heat down. <gasps> someone, someone loot him. Skeleton repair kit. Go ahead and take that. 
Um, someone take this. We're gonna just throw it on the throw it on the ground. Okay, okay, he is down. It took a lot of us. It took a lot of us to do it. Um, everyone, everyone on. Okay, let's go ahead and get these four. Uh, uh, well, let's get everybody repaired. Okay, the smart thing to do is get everyone repaired. Get everyone repaired. Um, where's this guy? Uh, whoa, whoa, no! <sighs> you know what? You know what? He died for a good cause. Uh, he wasn't... Someone that I really worried about too much. All right, let's get everyone repaired then. Oh, man. Why'd you have to die, man? That is sad. Okay, we no sitting around doing nothing. We need to get this this taken care of before we need to get somebody carrying him. We need to get uh, let's take our worst guy. This guy, he is our worst guy. Pick up, pick up the armor king. Okay, the armor king cannot do anything as long as he is being held. Also, I don't think they can swim. Because of the fact that they are, they can rust, I guess. Uh, but I'm going to keep him right there. Keep him right there. These guys, uh, we need to go ahead and check. Let's have Fu and Ja. He's right next to him. Take a look. Let's just take that stuff out of him. Take it out. Take it out of him. I'm not, I don't care if these are things that are valuable. Let's just take those out. It's like gutting, gutting them. Okay. Do we have any other losses? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We have ten here. We only had a single loss, which is very sad. Okay, Ming Long, pick up um This is so so sad. I I expected good things from him. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh, if I get another recruit, I'm gonna name him after him. Let me, I, let me, I, once I got my paper here, let me write down his name in the memory of, oh no, oh no, <laughs> come on, camera. This is the only problem I have with the game right now is camera. The camera is, uh, absolutely annoying. So we have, here he is. Oh, we need to loot him. Uh, two, just to make sure he doesn't have, okay, zoom in, X, U, M, I, E, N, S, H. So if we, if we recruit anyone, they will be the son. So it'll be, uh, zoom in Shah Jr. Okay. Kane, come over here. Trade with him. Trade with the dead guy. He didn't have anything I, I can use, actually. That's not a katana I was hoping for. Pick up. Come out here. Get into the water. going put down <sighs> that's sad but you know I sent him here to investigate uh, essentially because I wanted to make sure oh he's getting up good 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 um, to make sure that um, that this wasn't a hostile place. And if he died, I wasn't going to worry about it. That was my mindset. But he died. And now here we are.
Uh, just such a sad, sad situation. Okay, so let's go ahead and get Kane on here. Where's Kane? Where's Kane? We'll go ahead and get these guys on that. Go ahead and get these guys on this. Oh, yeah, check that out. Nothing in there. Any others that are... Let's check these, all of them. It's high grade. I could probably sell it for some money. Let's see what it's worth. Its value is 10000 but could only sell it for about not worth it. It's the it's the locked things that I'm I'm interested in. So let's go ahead and have him help with. Wait a minute. They opened it. High grade, high grade. Okay. Um. Who's getting this? Let's let's stop and think for a moment. We want to make sure that the right people are getting this. Um, Kane can actually carry things in his backpack. Let's go ahead and have him put that. Pretty much got a full set of, um, samurai. Minus the helmet. But I have a helmet back in the house. Grab that. And we won't use that. <coughs> okay. So, um... That was that one. That was this one. That was the lock one. Wait a minute. No, no, no. We want... Who is... Yeah, we'll, we'll get both of these guys. All four of them. Those are not locked. Wow, this one's probably going to take some time. Let's get everyone on this if we can. Or everyone we can get on it. Yeah, there we go. Might as well have everyone um, get to practice. Uh-oh. It's open. Okay, get everyone on that one then. Oh, no, 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 no. Mortis, Mortis. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Don't, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> that would have been bad. That's why he's the lowest ranking guy. <laughs> uh, the lowest ranking guy. Okay, let's go ahead and get uh, Ming Long over here for this. Rusty chain. High grade range. That is not what I was hoping for that said okay let's go ahead and have him check this one now why 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 can't you have recipes man why can't you be like smart and stuff and things all right range we'll get everyone in on this <laughs> uh, at least they they'll uh, their strength will go up again. They well they're I mean they're pretty hefty anyway. Mm. It's an iron hat standard grade. That's a masterwork grade. What's the well I'll take it okay. All right, who has the heaviest inventory? That's the next thing we need to know. 107, 148. Okay, let's say Kane. He needs to pick up one key Ying. He will now be the slowest guy. And he's still walking pretty good, actually. 
So um, let's get him here. Um, and let's go ahead and just have all of these guys. All of these guys. They're going to follow Kane. All right. In the name of Jaman Shah, we thank you. And now we're going to go ahead and head back to our village. Um, so let's go ahead and have them start swimming. Let's go ahead and go to the village. Uh, there's some things I need to change there. Okay. All right. So first things first, let's check inventories. Okay, he needs to go downstairs. Actually, let's just get all of them downstairs. Uh, he needs to stop here. So, research is done differently now. Um, one of those ways this research is done differently is you have to have books to do research. Now, these books won't help me anymore, uh, or at least at the current level that I'm at. Uh, it requires uh, ancient science research. It also requires um, ancient... I'm trying to think what the other thing is. Ancient science research as well as... Ah, I can't think of it. Uh, engineering engineering um, documentation. Those are the only two ways I can actually increase my technology. Currently, I am stuck um, because all of this um, still has... Now, farming is a different situation. Farming, I just need to find a hemp farm, and I cannot find a hemp farm anywhere. Uh, but that aside, um, let's go ahead and see. Crafting still. Uh, this is for robotics. Probably won't ever do the robotics stuff unless it's absolutely required. Uh, all the smithing stuff, and then also defense is all. I need to do all that. So, I'm at a standstill with my research. But I have some things that I want to do. The first thing is, I need to get this person and this person um, working on... Actually, just trying to think out loud here. Think um, out loud. Yeah. <laughs> um... Iron uh, raw iron plates. So let's come in here. We need storage. Storage for iron plates. And we'll go ahead and move this out a little bit. These only carry a 50 a piece. So I'm going to do two rows of them. Now I'm doing this because I'm trying to get ready for full full force manufacturing. I have yet to start manufacturing fabric, which is another thing I need to get on. Uh, but right now, I'm just trying to get all of the the hardest items to get to a point that I can actually start making armor and weapons and things like that. So confirm. Um, what are these take? They probably take iron plates. Of course they do. So we're going to take these two people. We're going to have them come up here. And let's take all of these guys again. Have them come up here. And what they're going to do is, the first thing, <laughs> they're going to break down these. Uh, because we don't want them to be putting iron plates here anymore. Then we're going to have them make iron plates to be able to finish the job that they're doing. Oh, also, that, that reminds me, there is one other thing we need to make over here. And this is probably one of the bigger things. Um, uh, crafting and mining right here. Iron refinery, 
we'll want to put that right. Well, we can go like this. We can be we're gonna be neat about it, I guess. Confirm. And then uh, what we'll end up doing is these guys will create all of this, create these and this. And then once that's done, I'm gonna completely close up shop up here. The only thing that's gonna be left here are these two generators, which are being fed. <laughs> Still, I guess. Um, so what I need to do is I need to have these two people work on this. And they need to get the resources from these guys who are actually taking them into boxes over here. Yeah, we're almost at a full stack. I also have this right here. If we ever get attacked by anyone, P, uh, we can put the weapons that we find and all of that into here. And it will turn them into raw iron. So we always have ways that we can make iron. And whenever we make any weapons or armor or anything along those lines, I'm probably going to make a row of these and just shove them right back in there so we can have new raw material to work with. And then we'll, we hopefully, I don't know what the conversion rate is, but maybe we'll be able to continually work without having to mine ore anymore. Yeah, I don't think that's going to be uh, possible, but we can at least hope. So let's go ahead and play. Oh, we're, we are playing. Okay. Uh, let's get Naroku. He needs to go ahead and start breaking these down. Dismantle. And also dismantle. And dismantle. <laughs> and dismantle. Okay. How are these going? Hopefully people are just waiting here for them to make these plates. How many people can work this machine actually? Only one worker. So everyone else, I can have Set just doing that. He doesn't have to take this person off of it. And all they're going to do is wait here for plates. Go and put plates where they need to be done. And yeah, once we get everything down to here... Oh, I know what we'll do. We'll have these people be the runarounds for them. Or who is actually doing the... He's making the plates. We'll go ahead and have this person auto haul. There we go. All right, let's go ahead and go back to these guys. Um, how is he doing? He's in a recovery coma. Everyone else is up and running. So these guys are still swimming to the destination that I told them to last. Alright, so they are doing uh, things over there. That's awesome. We can actually see what they're doing from here. Uh, but anytime they complete anything that we're working on, they will we'll, we'll get a notification. So... Other things they've changed, animals are in the game, there's two races that you can be, one of them is the robotic race, but if I played the robotic race, I'd want to wait until the whole map is available, and only get a robotic army, because it seems like they are very powerful, and I hate fighting them, especially that guy, who um, we're still carrying? Is he still carrying them? Where's he at? Are you still carrying the guy? He is. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and have him put him down. Look at that. He's now moving fast. Okay. Did he just sink to the depths? I think he did. I probably shouldn't have done that, actually. I should have probably, um, probably should have let him go once we looted his place. And then that way we would have been able to, um, okay, actually, which way are we going now? We're facing the way we need to go. Okay, so we need to continue this way. Ha! <laughs> 
<laughs> the water sounds are very, very weird. Okay. So these guys um, should be following Minglong or Kane, actually, wasn't it? Let's just get them all again. Click on here. Follow. And then I'll control Kane. So yeah, the um, the whole situation with that guy, I I wasn't smart. I should have just looted everything that he had it had it had, put him down, let him uh, rebuild his inventory, and then uh, do it all over again. <laughs> I mean, if we want to be very rude about it, um, that would have been the smart thing to do. But it didn't. That wasn't um, something I was thinking about. And now he is dead at the bottom of the river. So I think I'm going to go ahead and end here. I, I hope you guys liked it. Um, I really had planned to tell you more about what's going on in the game. But ended up showing you um, a pretty easy fight for what I thought was going to be very hard. Um, also, we saw the death of a, um, of a comrade who was going to um, hopefully one day grow up and become part of the Legion, uh, but never made it. Uh, I mean, he did what he was supposed to be doing, uh, which is scrap work, going around, uh, seeing if people are violent, <laughs> wherever it was. And the only reason I was doing that is because I have run into some very, very bad um, factions. One of them, which is the funniest one I've ever run into, is called the, um, they're called Screaming, I think. Let's go into Faction. Screaming or Screeching. Screaming. Screeching. Screeching Bandits. Okay, so Screeching Bandits. Um, uh, what they do is uh, they run around and all they're doing is yelling. Ah! <laughs> so finally one of them will come up to you and they'll say something along the lines of um uh, ah! <laughs> and your response choices are um uh yelling back at them or screeching back at them why are you guys clumped up right here get get out into the middle of the water okay kane is being weighed down that's the problem how is he doing? He's normal. Oh, he's the wrong guy. He's still in a recovery uh, situation. So, um, yeah, let's go ahead and keep moving this way. Um, so, anyway, they, they come up to you. They're ah, <laughs> screaming in your face. So, you have the option to scream back at them. You have the option to say, what are you saying? Or you have the option to say something along the line of, ha, 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 or something like that. And then, if you choose the wrong answer, which I don't know if there is a right answer, uh, they start attacking you. And these are naked. They have no armor on at all. Um, they <laughs> they have swords, but you we can take out three of them per one of my guys. So it probably take three or four of those guys one on one with one of my guys. But then you then you start to notice that you're not taking on. 20 men or even 40 of them you're taking on a hundred of them all at once and as one massive blob goes down a whole other group runs in from the side and so you are constantly being bombarded with with these guys coming in and hitting you but that's okay. I mean, they don't, they don't, um, they don't pick you up. They don't take you places or anything like that. It really actually wasn't too bad of a situation. There's also a group called the Fogmen. They are bug creatures and they, uh, they have two types. They have the heavies and they have the other kind that are smaller, weaker guys. So... You go in, they are automatically aggressive to you. Uh, again, faction... Nope, that's the wrong one. Map. 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 Uh, they they spawn in here. This is the fog that, that you see. Um, and the faction is called Fogmen, I believe. Just Fogmen. Fogmen. Fog. 
Yeah, right here. Automatic, 100% hate you, no matter what the reason is. You guys aren't swimming. Swim. Swim like butterflies. Um, but they will fight you um, in a swarm, kind of like what I was talking about with this, the Screeching Bandits. But they're strong, like the skeletons are. And um, their, their whole hive comes after you. And one of the things that I found most annoying about them is that uh, whenever one of your guys went down, you had no time to heal them because there was one of the tiny uh, guys coming in and picking up your guy and he was booking it, <laughs> booking it in some random direction. And then uh, you're like, okay, okay, we'll get them. We'll get them whenever we finish this fight. And then you're fighting again. You're, you're still going at it. And then the next thing you know, someone else goes down. And then this little guy comes in and he picks him up and he pulls him out. He takes him out and it goes in another direction. Some random direction that, uh, again, away from the other guy that's already down and being dragged around somewhere else. Finally... If you don't have the 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 sense to just book it and get out of there, um, which I didn't <laughs> when I first was was looking around, I was like I was new to this environment, really didn't know what was um, what the situation was, if they were gonna just lock him in some kind of um, cage, and then I would go and get him and it'd be fine. But finally, they get to the very last guy, and I'm just clicking between all my guys, and they're being dragged all over the Fog Nation. They're not stopping. They're not doing anything like that. They're not putting them in cages. They are literally straight up, straight up, um, <laughs> just moving them. And by this time... They've uh, they've gotten to the point where they've um, I'll stop here. Uh, I'll, I'll pause it. Um, pause it or slow down at least. Uh, by this time, they've switched who's carrying you. It's it's not it's not the little guys anymore. It's now the heavies. These these strong guys that beat you down in the first place, and where. Most situations, my guys can probably take on one, one to one or something along those lines. One to one or one to three. You take three guys to take out one of my guys. In this situation, that was not the case. It was a, situ a situation where, uh, oh, why is he not healed? Where is he at? Oh, he is healed. Okay. Um... It was a situation where they would not put you down at all. Did I lose lose track of what I was saying? <laughs> Probably did. Um, so I was never able to get my guys, never get anyone to become conscious again. Uh, none of those things, because my guys were always being held on a person's back. So whenever you're on the back of somebody, I you can't wiggle out of it at least that i know of and so my guys were a lot they were landlocked <laughs> in the grasp of the fog nation and so i had to restart my game completely because i i didn't have any saves yet i was pretty much just going around trying to explore the map and man fogmen are the worst so the factions are vast we've barely even touched on them as far as in my exploration um we still haven't uh, seen any of these guys some of them aren't even in the game currently and then also um Shek kingdom this is another new race that you're able to play um and we are now negative with skeletons because we ended up attacking that skeleton guy <laughs> um the Temple of Truth. The Holy Nation hates us a little bit. I don't know how to fix that. Uh, White Elbra, uh, Elbra, uh, Eyebrow Clan. Uh, Western Hive. 
twin blades, things like that. I don't know um, about any of those. Cannibals are another situation. Uh, they've done changes to them. Originally, I believe, whenever the, the cannibals came out, they would grab you the same way I was talking about the fogmen, but they would take you to, to cages in their camps. They were actually really hard to fight because there were a lot of them, and they were skilled in their weapons or in their craft of, of, kill, of attacking people, but they wouldn't kill you. Now what happens is you'll start to see your character dwindle down. Uh, they haven't put in the effect yet that you can completely lose an arm or a leg, but that will happen. And they also said that at some point, uh, whenever that happens, you'll be able to uh, create robotic legs and arms to replace them. So you'll be able to fix your amputees and make bionic men. But... Um, what the cannibals do currently is they will eat like your arm and your arm will become limp and it won't repair itself. Uh, then you'll have, um, they'll eat your legs. And finally, whenever they finish you off and you're completely gone, they will, uh, you'll die. So if you don't save your guys, if you don't find your guys and save your guys or your guys don't escape, they will eat you to death. <laughs> it, is, it is a very gruesome uh, reality. Oh, why is why are these guys not selected? Okay, so we need to go ahead and get all of everyone here. Is he carrying one keying still? He's, he's good, right? Okay, Kane, put him down. Come here. Why are you why are you pacing like that? Put him down. He's good. Catch up to catch up to Mingling. Minglong. There you go. So I think I'm going to go ahead and uh, finish the video here. Um, so yeah, the factions have changed, the gameplay has changed, and if you want to see more of this, let me know. Otherwise, uh, I plan to... Um, whoa, I can't move. I can't move the camera. I plan to start a brand new game at some point, and just start fresh. And the game I've always started with was... Merchant. I'll be a merchant and I'll go around and make money and then I'll start my thing. Well, I would like to show you guys how to start out as not being a merchant. As being poor, having a crappy sword, having almost no equipment, and seeing how you live. And also having to deal with the hunger and so on. So let me let me know how you guys what you want what you think what you're doing <laughs> and I'll talk to you next time. This is Cypher Deck. Peace out.